Should we stay away from vacant homes owned by corporate? The best thing you can do is to wait for that house to come on the market. The, the best thing you can do is to net ready. This is some gold I'm going to give you right now. For those of you guys who are listening, this is gold. Start finding out who the REO agents are in your area. An REO agent stands for real estate owned. That means that a bank owns real estate they, and they have agents that work for them that really exclusively list their properties. They usually have two or three agents that work with them to sell their properties. Ask them this question. Say, listen, do me a favor. Would you mind before it hits the open market, just let me know. And they can probably let you know the night before, right? So as soon as they get the listing, they might give you a call and say, hey, listen, go check out that house. If you want to put an offer in, get it in quick and Monday morning I'll take it. Because some banks... Some banks will not accept offers for the first three or four days because they want to drive the price up. Some banks will take the first offer because they don't want to mess around with it. You need to have kind of your business set up at that point, though, when you're making those kind of offers, though. You want to have your financing nah. and, you know. God, are you new here? We didn't have that when we first started. Well, you want to have some of your finances in place, but listen, I'm I'm more I'm much more of a uh, ready fire aim kind of a person. So. Well, okay, so you don't want to make an offer on that kind of house and and screw up a relationship that you want to start with an REO agent Fair if you're enough. not going to follow through. Fair enough. Because those are those are really important relationships to have. Very true. And, and there's there's a little more sequence to it than that. You're right. Mm-hmm.